Okay, James P. Madonna of Progressive Discussions. Uh, Mega Life 21. I am now going to vote. I am here at the Hilltop School in, uh, in Lodi, New Jersey. I am going to vote now. This is Election Day 2018. Yes, Tuesday, early afternoon, Election Day 2018. Probably one of the most important election days in modern day American history. All right. And uh, as you well know, I am definitely not going to vote for any conservatives, no Republicans. It, it will be a snowball's chance in hell that I vote conservative ever. But unfortunately, I am forced because I don't have the options. I am forced to vote for the lesser of two evils once again um, because I have a choice. Uh, either vote for the frying pan or the furnace. And uh, here in New Jersey, we are severely lacking well-backed, well-known, true progressive candidates here in the state of New Jersey. So I will enter right now. <clears throat> until, you know, um, until um, our revolution or the um, democratic uh, socialists of America or um, the Green Party or whatever progressives actually uh, are well known in New Jersey. They exist in New Jersey, but they are not well established yet. Until then, I have to settle for the two evils. Now, did you did you know that last time I voted some redneck libertarian uh, bastard with a long ZZ top beard looked like Phil from Duck Dynasty? You know, he he put up a big argument about the fact that there are signs in other languages. He made a big stink about it. This redneck guy, this right-wing redneck. He really put up a fight, an argument, not a fight, but an argument, a dispute about this fact. Unbelievable. All right. Now I will enter. I will probably see my, my longtime friend and former coworker from the 1990s here, Mr. Robert Gennaro, and now I enter. Okay, here I am, James P. Madonna, Progressive Discussions, ready to vote, uh, November 2018 election, Tuesday, on a rainy day, but the rain does not stop me. No way, no how. I am here to do the right thing. Here we go. I'm not even going to pay attention to these, to these demons, to these demons. I'm not paying attention. Of course, I do not know any of these independent candidates, unfortunately. Unfortunately, I do not know them. And this is the problem we have here in New Jersey. The independents are just not being backed full force by organizations like Our Revolution. I, I hope in the very near future they will be. I hope they will be backed. Okay, here I am voting for the lesser of two evils once again. Okay. Got it? You got it, jabronis? The lesser of two evils. Oh, a public question. Securing our Children's Future Bond Act. Okay. I say it sounds good to me. It sounds progressive to me. I'll vote yes. Okay. What do we got here? Local, cr local crap. Official school election ballot. I guess Board of Education. All right. Uh, 
I like their political ads that they dropped off on my house. Okay. I don't really get involved in local politics, really, but what the hell, I'm here, right? Might as well. Okay. Okay, America, this is how we do it in New Jersey. It's controversial. Some people say the paper ballot is best, but any, any form of voting can be corrupted and rigged. Corrupted and rigged. There's a lot of noise here, I'm sorry. Cast vote. That's it. Done deal. See you on the next election day. James P. Madonna, Progressive Discussions, Mega Life 21. Okay, this is James P. Madonna, Progressive Discussions, Mega Life 21. I have voted. I have cast out the demons. Well, we hope we're going to cast out the demons today. Uh, Tuesday, uh, Election Day, uh, November uh, 2018. We hope we're going to cast the demons uh, at least out of the House of Representatives. And, uh, oh, lovely. I smell carbon monoxide fumes as I'm leaving. But anyway, that's it. I voted. I did my duty. Oh. And let's just see. Uh, if the voter turnout was large enough this election day, November 2018. Okay, I want to give a, a, a greeting to the only true progressive in the state of New Jersey, progressive candidate Lisa McCormick. And I also want to give a shout out to her partner, uh, Mr. Jim Devine. And... Uh, and please, our revolution, American Socialists of America, if that's the correct title. Uh, I don't see the Green Party out here, but definitely get behind the progressives uh, before the next election here in the Garden State because many of the politicians, unfortunately, especially two-party system politicians, uh, our uh, corporate whores, typical two-party system corporate whores, they are corporatists, and uh, if they pass away, uh, they're so crooked, you will have to screw them into the ground like a corkscrew, unfortunately, but that's it, bye-bye.